Hey everyone, I'm Mike Austin with Taylor Guitars and today we're talking about tone woods. We want to start with the most popular of tone woods that you'll find through most guitar manufacturers and particularly Taylor and that's Indian Rosewood. Indian Rosewood has a very distinct look to it, that real chocolatey brown hue and you'll notice a couple of things about it. First, it has a great low-end response. Nice, nice low-end punch. You get this nice top-end sizzle and that mid-range is kind of scooped away so if you're a singer-songwriter you can lay your voice right in the middle. You'll also notice an enormous volume swell, so you get a much more uh, commanding volume output from Indian Rosewood. So if you're interested in trying Indian Rosewood, we encourage you to look for Taylor's 700, 800, and 900 series guitars. Mahogany is a tone that has been very popular amongst guitar makers as well as players because it really has this balanced and woody type tone to it with a strong, powerful mid-range, almost like a bell curve on an EQ response. It has strong fundamental notes, so that limited you know, amount of overtones can really sit in and play great with other instrumentation. So it plays well with others. It's great for singer-songwriters uh, who are looking for a real expressive and articulate sounding guitar. So that all mahogany guitar can really uh, work well with both finger style and a flat picker scenario. We invite you to look for our mahogany and our new 300 series mahogany top guitars, as well as our newly designed all mahogany 500 series collection. Maple as a tone wood is really superb for folks doing both stage and studio. Maple is a very dense wood, so that means it's inherently going to be very bright and have this really nice top end sparkle to it. Uh, it has a real quick decay, so if you're a jazz player or even a solo acoustic guitar player, those notes get out of the way of each other. They don't really trip all over each other. If I'm a recording artist and I really need a guitar to sit in its own sonic space in a mix, Maple is perfect for that situation. It's also wonderful for folks who have a much higher uh, EQ range with their voice. So now that their voice isn't really fighting the guitar, it kind of lives harmoniously with the tone of the maple. So if you're looking for something along those lines, we really invite you to check out our Maple 600 series collection. At Taylor Guitars, we really like telling the story of the heritage of Hawaiian koa. Koa only comes from one place on the globe, and that's from the Big Island in Hawaii. It has this really strong variegation or grain pattern that's actually accentuated by the shaded edge burst that we put on it. Koa in the beginning sounds like a combination of both mahogany and maple. So you get this nice punchy mid-range, this nice top end sizzle. But as the guitar is played in over time, you start to gather this low end response. So that sonic footprint is actually getting bigger as you play the guitar longer. Folks who have a nice finger style approach or are looking for that real velvety kind of strumming output will really gravitate towards the Koa's voice and you'll find Koa exclusively on Taylor's Koa series guitar collection. For more discussion on shapes and tone woods and all things Taylor guitars, please contact your Sweetwater sales engineer.